The Dome Creek Mummy is a preserved adult male bison dating to the late Ice Age, and it is now held at the National Museum of Natural History. It was found at Dome Creek, historically part of the Fairbanks Mining District, way back in 1951. Like the muskox mummy I covered earlier, this mummy was found by gold miners, looking for gold in the summer muck with hydraulics. After it was sent to the Smithsonian Institute in the 70s, it was given a date of roughly 31,000 years old, but it was apparently given another date of 28,000 years old, which it has kept since. To prevent further damage, the collector stitched the hide together with dental floss, and this is kept on the specimen still visible today. In the summer, falling soil can flow down hills, a process called soil reflection. This material known as loess sometimes buries and preserves animal and plant remains along with frozen soil known as permafrost and can slide them into nearby streams. Eventually, sometimes thousands of years later, frozen limbs, tails, or even entire bodies can be unearthed, often at gold placer mines such as the one in this image. I covered this topic before in the muskox mummy video, and the sources I got this from also covered it in detail, and will likely get linked in the video description. The mummy was once listed as belonging to Bison Crassicornis, or the large horned or big horned bison. Later mummies like Blue Babe were classed as Bison Priscus, or the Step Bison. Eventually, Bison Priscus and Bison Crassicornis were considered to be the same. These giant bison lived in Europe, Asia, and North America throughout the Ice Ages and survived in Alaska as recently as 5,000 years ago, though it died out in most areas a lot earlier. They lived with many other herbivorous predators and humans in the rich biome known as the Mammoth Step. For more detail on that, check out the Ice Age Yak video and the Ice Age Muskox Mummy video, or the aforementioned sources I got the information for both those videos from, which covered these mummies and specimens in a lot of detail. It is one of only a few more intact mummies of the species from Alaska, despite the fact that they were very common here. Other mummified bison and Ice Age mammals are often found in Siberia. While not as famous as Blue Babe, a more complete mummy from nearby Fairbanks discovered in 1979, also by gold miners, it is still helpful in letting us learn more about this now extinct fascinating creature. Along with plant matter, its gut and body parts, DNA can help us learn and perhaps maybe even bring back one someday. Now that's quite a story for an old bison carcass from a stream and some dental floss.